हेलो माय डियर व्यूअर्स वेलकम टू सिंपलीफाइड सिविल एंड जियोटेक्निकल इंजीनियरिंग चैनल आई एम प्रोफेसर अक्षय जायसवाल टुडे इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस ऑन प्लेट लोड टेस्ट बाय यूजिंग रिएक्शन ट्रस मेथड सो लेट्स गो थ्रू सेटअप ऑफ प्लेट लोड टेस्ट before starting the video three questions should come in our mind then only we can understand the plate load test easily first one is what is plate load test second one is why it is conducted and third one is what is the actual use of plate load test a foundation is that part of the structure which transmits the weight of the structure to the ground it is the connecting link between the structure and the ground hence a foundation is required to distribute the load on a large surface area and hence the foundation is required to be designed such that the soil below the foundation does not fail in shear and the settlement is within the safe limit the pressure which the soil can safely withstand is known as allowable bearing pressure by using this test we can determine the allowable bearing pressure ultimate bearing capacity of the soil and settlement in the foundation and further this data is used by the structural designer to design the foundation and complete building structure and hence the plate load test is very important plate load test is done at site for clay and sandy soils the plate load test is mandatory in case of designing foundation over the sandy and clay soil the test gives the highest rate of accuracy in determining the safe bearing capacity of soil in case of shallow foundations plate load test is suitable for cohesion less soil as in case of cohesive soil longer duration is required for settlement to take place let's see the importance of plate load test this test is very important because it helps in deciding the best type of the foundation as in case if the safe bearing capacity of the soil is less then we need to adopt the rough foundation and in case if the soil conditions are detrimental then we need to perform the analysis of the soil as per recommendations now let's see what is bearing capacity of soil the strength for resisting the compressive stress is called the bearing capacity of the soil now we will see the field methods to determine the bearing capacity of the soil first one is analytical method involving the use of soil parameters second one is plate load test on the soil third one is penetration test and last one is presumptive bearing capacity values from is code now we will see the factors affecting the safe bearing capacity of the soil important factors are given here first one is type of soil second subsurface water table third the density of the soil fourth void ratio and last one is porosity let's see the types of plate load test in detail 
varieties in platelet test and their durations platelet test is performed under two variations first one is gravity load test which is also known as reaction loading method second one is reaction truss method the apparatus used in above mentioned two tests are different but the principle and calculations involved in finding the shape bearing capacity of the soil are same the total duration required to perform the plate load test may vary from 6 to 7 days as it includes installation test conduction and dismantling the test results in case of the soft strata may be obtained within the few hours but in case of the hard strata it might take couple of days hope you like the information given in this video if you are watching my channel for first time then click on subscribe and share with all your friends thanks for watching jai hind vande mataram